Thank you so much for joining me. I wanted to take this time to share with you the benefits of hand massage. And I also would like to show you some techniques that you can use to give yourself a very relaxing hand massage. Hand massage can provide you with significant health benefits. And some of them you can begin to see immediately when you begin to treat yourself to a hand massage. Hand massage typically is quick, relaxing, and provides you with immediate health benefits, such as improved finger and wrist range of motion and enhanced circulation. Your hands contain many acupressure and reflexology points, which are associated with your organs and certain parts of your body. So taking care of your hands can ultimately give you all around benefits. If you use your hands for repetitive tasks, either at work or at home, such as typing, texting, writing, or if you often experience pain or cramping in your hands, a hand massage can help in decreasing that pain and can allow you to continue your work in a pain-free state. Hand massage also helps to loosen tight hand muscles, reduces scar tissue, and adhesions that cause decreased finger and wrist mobility, and improves your hand's various ranges of motion and flexibility. Let's get started by gently spreading some lotion over the hands. You can use any lotion you like. I'm going to personally use a lotion that I actually made myself. I was inspired when I noticed my hands and face becoming very dry in the winter time. So I found this lovely lotion recipe online and decided to make it myself. It's made with beeswax, which I just ordered from Amazon, almond oil, jojoba oil, and olive oil, and a few drops of lavender essential oil because it smells so nice and is a very calming scent. I also love the way it's encased in this lovely little jar, which has a very pleasant sound to it. So we're just going to open it up and get a fairly generous amount and begin to distribute it onto the hands. The basic massage motions are effleurage, which is long, continuous movement, petrissage, which is the gentle kneading of the muscles, ringing or friction, which is deep rubbing to the muscles, rotation, as well as rubbing and vibrating techniques. During effleurage, the skin is exfoliated, and throughout the entire massage, blood circulation is stimulated, supplying the skin with much needed oxygen leaving it well-nourished and, with the help of the lotion, hydrated and moisturized. So after we've distributed the lotion onto the hands, we're going to begin by just lightly pulling on the hand. Moving on to the thumb, the little fingers, the index finger, the ring finger, and the long finger. Lightly rotate your hand to increase the range of motion and flexibility and extension. And we're just going to go between the thumb to rub the muscles and just begin to rub the muscles in between the bones that connect to the fingers. If 
You can also use your knuckles to just stretch out the hands and the fingers and knead all the muscles, crossing very lightly against the bones. You can use friction to rotate the skin, the wrist and hand and fingers. And now we're just going to repeat the cycle one more time. Lightly pulling on the hand, moving on to the thumb, the little finger, the index finger, the ring finger, and the long finger. Lightly rotate your hand to increase the range of motion, increasing that flexibility and extension. Going between the thumb to rub the muscles, and rub the muscles in between the bones that connect to the fingers. You can also use your knuckles to really stretch out the hands and the fingers and just knead all the muscles, crossing very lightly against the bones once more. And using the friction to rotate the skin of the wrist and the hand and the fingers. And just finish it out with effleurage more long, continuous movements. I hope that you enjoyed learning some benefits of hand massage and will use some of these techniques to treat yourself or a loved one to a very calm and soothing and relaxing hand massage. I hope that you have a wonderful, restful, peaceful day or night, and I hope that you'll join me again sometime soon.